Olivia, can you tell us how that feels to have scored the winner in the stadium? Uh, it's, it's a great feeling, I think, and uh, I'm really happy for, for my for my team and for the for my team and for myself too. And I appreciate the, the atmosphere tonight. It was a brilliant atmosphere, and I think everybody is happy now. The players deserved it. After we scored the equaliser in the second half, we were the better team. Yeah, I think we we managed the game in more or better in the second half. I think we, we could start the game really a little bit slow. And then after the first goal we scored, I think we get in, in the game and after it was it was a good game to play. And even for the supporter to, 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 to see a game like this, I think they can be really proud of, of the team and stuff like that. Yeah, the atmosphere with so many thousands of Celtic fans, that must have been great to play in. It was a great atmosphere and even as a Celtic fan, they can be proud today to have a team like Celtic today. The way we play, the, 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 the team spirit was really, really, really nice tonight. And when you came on, did the manager tell you, just score the goal in the last minute to win? Uh, <laughs> he just said to me, just try to defend a little bit and the way you press is, and try when you get the ball, try to, to play forward and to make the team keep the ball better. You must be pleased with the finish because it was from a, a difficult angle and the goalkeeper was, was coming out to close you down. Yeah, it was a difficult angle, but it was too quick to even to explain that. But, but I was really proud of my finishing today. And as a footballer, those must be the moments that you really love when you, when you score a goal to win a game. The first time Celtic have won in Italy. I didn't know that, but, but I think it's a good news for everybody now. You've created Celtic history tonight. Congratulations. Thank you.